So this is our time of year where our cucumber plants are you know, loaded and abundant. You know, we're finding them at farmer's markets and roadside stands. So I'm going to show you with a step-by-step -step on how to take our cucumbers and can them and make dill pickles. So the first thing we want to do is gather all of our materials so we don't have to go run around the kitchen looking for them once we get started. So you need pickling cucumbers, grape leaves or alum, garlic, and dill. So you also need vinegar, pickling salt, jars, lids, and rings. To start with, you'll want to sanitize your lids, rings, and jars in boiling water. You'll also want to wash and clean your pickling cucumbers. So starting with a large pot on the stove, we need to make a brine. And in the pot, we'll use four cups vinegar, four quarts water, and one cup pickling salt. We'll bring this mixture to a boil, and this will make about eight quarts. So next, you'll take your sanitized jars and you'll start the process of pickling. We'll add either alum or a grape leaf, two sprigs of dill, and a clove of garlic. The alum or grape leaf help make the pickles crisp. Next, we'll pack our cucumbers into the jar, leaving just enough room below the neck. Next, we'll ladle in the brine, leaving about a half inch below the top of the jar. Next, we'll take a clean, wet paper towel and wipe the rim of the jar, removing all the excess brine. This will allow for a nice, clean, tight seal of the lid. So next, we'll put on the lid and the ring and we'll hand tighten. That'll keep the lid from shifting during sealing. So next, we'll put the jars into the canner. We want to do it on the opposite sides to keep it balanced. We'll then lower the jars into the boiling water. We'll put a lid on there and boil it for about 15 minutes. After their hot water bath, We'll remove the jars and let them cool and seal. You may even hear them pop as the lids seal. Dry down the jars and make sure you put the date on the top of the jar. Let the jars sit for 30 days to soak up all that great dill flavor. And with the sealed jars, you'll have up to two years to enjoy your dill pickles. For more information on canning or pickling, go to gardentime.tv and we'll click you over to the OSU Food Preservation website.